Uh, the past two weeks I've been able to lose a lot of weight as you've seen if you're following the video series and um, I just want to stop and recognize the fact that you know again we all have faults and doing this process and uh, consistently trying to lose weight and uh, getting down to where I am right now losing like 11, 12, 13 percent my body fat and getting to a pretty normal health uh, health level as well as a good healthy weight has been fantastic and now I'm trying to go below that and trying to get into the really health uh, really healthy um, set of uh, area in my life but it's not good when you're starving yourself like I have been at times where I feel like I need to hit a certain goal and I'm eating enough and I'm doing a blood pressure test and I see that my systolic or diastolic is getting kind of low and my heart rate's getting higher that's unhealthy and so my confession to you is the fact that I'm not doing what I'm supposed to I'm not eating properly I'm trying to put goals in my mind that are not matching up with the realities of this world and as good as it is to lose weight and be very disciplined if you go overboard you can really really hurt yourself and that's kind of where I'm at right now I'm really sluggish the past couple days I'm quick to anger pride is setting in because I want to get to a certain level at a certain point at a certain time frame. I want to lose 80 pounds in 8 months. Well to be honest with you that's a little unhealthy and unrealistic. So I am going to be eating. I don't know how my weigh-in is going to go this week. If I don't lose much or lose at all or if I gain some, that's going to happen. I have a wedding this weekend. I'm closing up my school session with the kids that I work with. You know I'm working out. I'm doing a lot of things and for me to feel dizzy and not feeling good about my body and stuff like that that is not right and that's not how you should be doing it so I want to be a living testimony and this is why the series is with a six month or a year lag um, whenever I get the videos out in the future because I want to make sure that I'm doing this thing healthy I'm not lying to you that you actually feel that you're a part of this process and you can do it as well and I just had this confession that pride set in um, not doing things the right way set in and I just have to get back on track. I have to eat healthy, eat the right amounts, not try to you know shave off a thousand or twelve hundred calories a day, but realize that my body's starting to lose a lot now, and I need to be doing this on for a healthy reason, healthy levels. And so you know I'm going to cut it down to probably only six or eight hundred calories a day. It's going to take a little bit longer than I wanted it to. I am worried about money and everything that I always have been worried about. Um, in you know situation, I'm not really talking about the finances and how my life is and all the hardships that I'm going through. But uh, I'm worried about those things and I'm not letting God take control. So in this series, in this situation, my confession, I apologize that I uh, haven't been the best motivator and leader. Uh, even though you may never meet me or know me, I just, I'm doing this series to do that. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all your support. Thank you for your comments and your likes. And anyone who is watching this, you're a blessing. And yes, you know what? Myself, I go through it as well. We all go through it. It's not just, you know, you lose a couple pounds or you, you know, see these pictures of people who lose like 130 pounds and that's it. You go through day to day ups and downs, problems, depression, all kinds of things. So, you know, just keep your head up, keep working really hard, keep doing your thing and I just wanted to say sorry to all of you that uh, I should have been doing a better job for my own safety, my own health. I should not have let my diastolic and systolic drop that low uh, and have my heart rate go that high and get stressed out and all that stuff. I need to be more patient, more calm, rest more and not go after the ideals of what people tell me to do or what I set up in my mind but what's healthy and what's godly and doing and putting the right things first and not you know trying to starve out on a meal or doing things that are, are not good. So my confession is that and I hope that I'm back on the right track and I hope that some of you who may have been watching the past videos who were like, wow, he's still you know, ripping through weight the way he is, that I probably wasn't doing it in the right way. And that's why, again, I say I'm not a professional. And I've said it countless times, I'm not a person who's a doctor. This is just me with the years of experience that I've had uh, and trying to show this and display this this project to you. And at any time if I felt that this project was getting out of hand or wasn't doing things properly or doing things that wasn't going to be good for people, then I would stop the series. And uh, that's why there is a six months to a year lag. So thank you my you dudes and my you gals for watching. You've been fantastic through this whole process. I'm going to still push forward, but I'm not going to be pushing myself as hard. I'm going to be more relaxed. I'm going to try not to stress myself out. And it's about healthy living. It's about healthy living. It's about doing things right with your body, your mind, and your spirit. Oh yeah, and if you like what I'm doing, please... Tweet! Tumble! Like! Share! Thumbs up! Plus, pin, or do whatever you do, and please, subscribe.